Because just like the archery, if you miss the target, it's hopeless. With archery, you may not hit the bull every time, but the more times you connect with the target, the greater the chance you've got of making a bull. And in business, the greater the times you connect with your target audience, the greater the chance you've got of making a sale. The telephone. You know, everyone's sitting doing this. Even during the lectures, everyone's sitting doing this. That's okay. But you wouldn't be able to do any of that if it wasn't for us, Lord. We invented the phone. Golf. I'm not much of a golfer myself. You, you have a stick thing, and you have a right thing, and you swear, and you walk, and then you have a drink. You see, that's two companies in two identical industries in the same town, offering the same service at the same price, but with two wildly different ways of doing it. And the ways of doing it are their brands. The journey so far is we've worked out what industry you're going in and which position. We've worked out what your DNA is, in other words, what your brand is. We've summarized your brand by thinking all the why you's, and then we've given those few words, which I call a brand message or your mission statement, that you're going to go into battle with. Now all I'm asking you to do is lead with them in your advertising. Nobody's interested in your company name to start with. They're really not. What they're interested in is what you can do for them. I wish you all the very best, and thanks for coming.